world. <laughs> we have an amazing group of, Al of Alabama fans here. And I have an amazing person, Dee Dee Bonner, who, of course, you're, you're A.J. McCarron's mom, which, looking at you, I find hard to believe. <laughs> but, um, but how... My new best friend. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, I mean, how... We, we saw last year when uh, Alabama beat LSU, A.J. became so emotional on the sidelines, he burst into tears, mm -hmm. and then he came found you guys in the, in the stands, and you guys all were kind of had, had that moment. How emotional is this game against LSU, and why do you think he got so emotional last year? I think it was a release for him, having lost to them prior to that. He just carried a lot of weight on his shoulders in the regular season. When that loss, he took it personal, and he didn't want to let his teammates down, making sure that he had the win for them and for the seniors and the guys that would be going in the draft. And he just carried everything on his shoulders. They weren't clicking earlier in the game. So just, you know, with a minute 34, whatever it was left for them to drive down the field and get the touchdown was just uh, amazing. And I think it was just a release point for him. And how tough is it for you to be a mom? Because there are some horses, you know, <laughs> in, in SEC football. Then they're all out to bury your son into the turf every week. How tough is it for you as a mom to watch your son try to avoid these 350 pound guys? You obviously don't know my reputation because I'm mama bear, so it's all funny until I get a hold to him. After that. <laughs> so they should watch out for they you. They need to watch out to watch for watch my out five foot four, exactly. So. exactly. Now, of course, you guys were in the spotlight for a whole different reason earlier this year. The national championship game against Notre Dame. They show AJ's girlfriend Catherine Webb <laughs> on on the you know on national TV, and of course the response was, shall I say, um, overwhelming. Um, what was it like? for your son to have to share the spotlight with his girlfriend, Catherine Webb? Uh, you, when you're with Catherine, you share the spotlight. I mean, I'm like, would you stop walking beside me when we walk down the street? I mean, it's like, walk up ahead of me or something for the love of Pete. I mean, she's just, she's amazing. So he just, he's happy for her and everything that's come her way. I mean, they're just a great couple. So he's ecstatic for her. Let's see here, AJ's a good looking guy. She's a good looking girl. I'm thinking good looking grandbabies. What do you think? I'm hoping, wow, really? I'm hoping. AJ, if you're watching right now, this is what mom wants. Exactly. Mom gets what she wants. Exactly. Give me a prediction on the game this weekend. Uh, I win for the Alabama Roll Tide. What do you mean? That's us. <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. I really Thanks appreciate you joining us. You guys are amazing. More Morning Express. With, oh, you know what? We've got broadcasting students here. Guys, send us a break real quick. Here, here you go. All right. More from Rivalry Express coming up. On Morning Express with Robin Mead. From Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Roll Tide. Roll Tide. Good job, guys. Good job. Good job.